A developer posted a leak that seems to be a teaser for the Fallen mode. I'm not sure if this is the new Fallen King or one of the new enemies in Fallen mode. What do you think? If this is the new Fallen King, I guess we'll have to say goodbye to the old one. What are your thoughts? Is this the new Fallen King, or is it just one of the enemies in the upcoming reworked Fallen mode? Most of you have probably seen the updated lobby with the weird structure beside the spawn point, right? We can see a classic baseplate area. And in this video, I mentioned that TDS is likely part of the classic event in Roblox because they uploaded 15 new badges, indicating their participation. It is now confirmed that we are getting another event mentioned in a previous roadmap as the mini event. In one of Creekcraft's videos about classic Roblox, the portals look similar to the ones we have in the game, adding more evidence that TDS is part of the classic event. Note that this event is coming out on May 23rd, which is only a few days away. Let's predict what we might see in the classic event. And also, yes, yeah, subscribe to Gazzy. So I think we will see some old enemies from TDS, and there's a chance we may encounter the Golden Mode enemies, or enemies from the Sword Fights on the Heights event, also known as the Gladiator event. It would be awesome if TDS decides to use all the old enemy models for the classic event, giving OG players a nostalgic experience. We might also get another countdown like with the Hunt event, but since it's still early and it's weekend, they might do this during the weekdays. So, a new teaser for the Fallen mode has been released, but I'm unsure if it's a remodel of the Fallen King or a new enemy. The developer might release another teaser for the Fallen mode rework soon. I will keep you posted with any new information or leaks about TDS. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again later.